Brand new tapes of Jordan Graham, the Montana woman who pled guilty last week to pushing her husband off a cliff just eight days after their wedding. The tape shed new light on what led to that fatal moment. ABC's Ryan Owens has the details. How could he know he would only live eight more days? This wedding video is some of the evidence the jury saw in the trial of newlywed killer Jordan Graham. A federal judge unsealed it after the 22-year-old pleaded guilty late last week to second-degree murder. The jury also watched Graham's maid of honor speaking about her best friend, the bride. Kim Martinez turned on Graham and was among the first to testify against her. This morning, the killer bride is behind bars after admitting she pushed Cody Johnson face first off a cliff at Montana's Glacier National Park back in July. I don't know anything more. We're also getting our first look at the police interrogation videos showing Graham lying over and over. Here she is two days after the murder, telling a detective her husband just went on a joy ride. Going to go for a ride with some of his out of town buddies that are visiting. And here she is the very next day with her mom. She's come back to show police an email on her phone. I got an email this morning from some guy all it said was Tony. That email was fake. Graham sent it to herself to throw off authorities. It didn't work. Finally, days after Johnson's body was found, his bride fessed up to an FBI agent. She shoved him during an argument. He went to grab my arm and my jacket, and I said, no. I said, I'm not going to have this happen. I'm going to defend myself. So I kind of let go, and I pushed, and he went over. And then I took off and went home. It's all evidence the jury heard but never had to consider. Graham's surprise guilty plea stopped the trial after just four days. For Good Morning America, Ryan Owens, ABC News, Dallas. Boy, hearing those tapes is chilling.